Oh hi, Swordman here, and I'm back with another video. And boy oh boy do I have a treat for you today. No, this is not a Wolverine cosplay, this is an actual weapon in the game. What you're looking at here is the Hook Claw, which is one of the best in slot bleed weapons currently going. It's a lot of fun to use, it's super quick, causes all that bleed damage, and better still, it's actual special ability allows you to dash forward or backwards or whichever direction you want. The dash is a bit quicker than dodge roll, trust me I know I'm on a dexterity build, which gives you that mobility to reposition yourself for a fatal attack. It has a nice heavy attack combo and better still you can jump home from the air and look like Wolverine, who does not want to do that? Combine this deadly strike with a spirit summon and you can sneak up behind your foe and just tear him on you, well, everything. It has a bleed build up of 60, which if you compare it to the blood dagger, this is only 50 as standard. You can run this single claw or dual claw, don't be alarmed when you get it, you'd think you've already got the one, but you just need to make sure you equip it on both hands. And for a truly deadly combo, Try pairing this with a blood dagger. You'll be surprised at how much damage you can go off with just a few different combos. And that bleed is just Jeff's kiss. So to get this weapon, stick around and I'll show you how. So the first thing you're gonna need to do before you can actually get this weapon is kill Margaret the Ill Omen. But don't panic if you can't kill him. I have a very simple and easy guide where you don't even have to attack the guy for him to die. So just go follow that. I'll leave a link in the description below. But once you've done that, you want to make your way to the left on the cliff side and from here you can either fight your way through or just run to the end and grab the item let me show you how if you want to make your way up the cliff um, it's best to sneak here and just make sure the guard doesn't see you. otherwise it's going to sound as trumpet which to be honest doesn't really do too much it's just annoying but you can pretty much knock them off the edge without even having to fight them um these creatures bosses mobs whatever you want to call them they're not too strong to be honest they are quite weak but they will hit hard so just make sure you aren't taking too much damage from him. Uh, as you can see here, I'm still a noob, so leave me alone. But I am using the great Epi here, in case you're wondering. I love this sword. And there's my blood dagger. Boom, bye bye, get out of my way. So make your way up the steps. As I said, you can just run past here and then just go straight through that door. Don't walk around, there's nothing there to see. You have two enemies in front of you. You can pretty much one bang these. I don't understand the point of them. Uh, they can be annoying though, so just hit them. Uh, don't worry that's the message it's not actually anything to find here thank you trolls of Elden Ring and then what you want to do is make your way to the back of this room there is a big strong guy on the right hand side you can just sneak past and avoid him as I said if you want to do this the cheese way you just literally run up and grab this and on the corpse as you can see the hook claw and that is my very easy way to get the hook claw Hope you enjoyed the video, hope you find it useful, comment below if there's anything else you want to know, and of course, if you can, leave a like, subscribe, and uh, catch you on the next one. Peace.